Hi, and welcome to this e-lightning presentation for the Planetary Defense Conference of 2021. Today, we will present to you the development of a highly autonomous guidance, navigation and control system for the Juventus CubeSat. Juventus, as a part of the Hera mission, is one of the two CubeSats to be released in the vicinity of the Dinimor's binary asteroid system. Its main objectives are to study the internal structure the surface properties and the gravitational field around the Morphos, the smallest component of the binary asteroid system. Juventus will achieve these two last objectives, thanks to a controlled landing on the surface of the Morphos, and this task requires a high onboard autonomy. Juventus will be equipped with two intersatellite link antennas, and these antennas will be used for communication with ground through HERA. It, uh, they will also be used for ground navigation thanks to range and range rate measurements between HERA and the CubeSats. The GNC system will use a navigation camera to take pictures of the asteroid and also a laser altimeter to measure the distance from the CubeSat to the surface of the asteroids. These instruments will be pointed towards the main asteroid and only during the landing phase they will be pointed towards the smallest component of the asteroid, the Morphos. Juventus will make use of a really interesting type of orbits called sun-stabilized terminator orbits. This only occur in environments where the gravitational pull of the main body is comparable to the solar radiation pressure perturbation acting on a spacecraft. This allows for a low maintenance and the GNC system will be in charge of ensuring that all the payloads are being pointed towards the main asteroid, thus ensuring the scientific outcome of the mission. Lastly, at the end of the mission, Juventus will attempt to land on the surface of the Morphos. This is a complex task that will require onboard autonomy for maneuver corrections of the trajectory of, the, of Juventus towards the asteroid. This is meant to maximize the chances of a successful landing and, and thus ensuring that the two last objectives of the mission are being met. Juventus will correct for any dispersion that, that has been introduced by this in this unknown environment and, uh, and then it will land on the surface of the asteroid. Thank you very much for assisting to this enlightening presentation and if you have any further uh, need of information please i will be glad to answer you via email thank you very much